So in this short video, I'm just going to show you how to save data for yourself or for your clients if you're using the software to conduct research for clients. So all you have to do is basically at the very bottom here, you'll see the file button and you can save to project files. Now the project files are specific only to the software. So if you're just using the software for yourself and you want to save data, after you conduct your research, just go ahead and save to project file and just save it to wherever and say this is cleared out. Then you want to load it back up, load project file, and only recognize the project files that will be able to open up in this software. So that's sort of just for yourself. Now, if you want to save other data, you can save to comma delimited file. So go ahead and save that, or a text file, or you can save all the keywords to comma delimited file, or to a text file. And now you can go and let's go take a look at that data. So in the file button, you'll also see open last working folder. If you click that and we'll see where we just saved all that stuff. So I'll go modified here and this is the keywords. Those are the keywords there. And we can see it in Microsoft Excel as well. We can also get access to all the data. And these are the reports you would send out to your customers. And you, if you have the uh, search volume, uh, you see that there, uh, monthly searches, CPC and competition, if you have that in there as well, uh, it will be into the report. If you don't see it here, you have to get it with using the search volume button. And you can refer to the other help video where I show you how to do that. Now with the niche analyzer, it's pretty much the exact same thing. You can go ahead and just save the data to a common limited file. And you can see it here. You got all this awesome data that you can use for yourself or provide to your customers. So everything's here. And again, if you got the monthly searches, CPC and competition, you, it will be included in here as well. It's the same thing as the other tool. Just click the search volume and you can go ahead and grab it as I show in that other video. And so it's really that simple to save data, open data, and give these particular files to your customers so that um, they can conduct their own research. Or sorry, you're conducting research for them so that they can go and work in these possible niches. That's it for this short video. I'll see you in the next one.